Hello, and welcome to the presentation for Thinking Fast and Slow, Combining Vector Spaces and Knowledge Graphs. First, let me introduce myself. My name is Sudeep Mittal, and I'm a PhD candidate in Computer Science and part of the Accelerated Cognitive Cybersecurity Lab at UMPC. Knowledge representation is one of the central challenges in the field of artificial intelligence. While representing knowledge through different methods, there is an inherent information loss. For example, by representing knowledge just as vector embeddings, we lose the declarative character of information. While knowledge graphs are adept at asserting declarative information, they miss important, important contextual information around the entity or are restricted by the expressibility of the baseline ontology schema that is used to represent the knowledge. To overcome limitations of both and take advantage of their complementary strengths, we have developed the VKT structure that is part knowledge graph and part vector embeddings. Together, they can be used to develop powerful inference methods. Some agents which can be developed over the VKT structure are a query processing system, an agent which adds domain knowledge to embeddings using the knowledge graphs, an agent which uses the vector representation to do link prediction in a knowledge graph, and some others. Here we have an example for a VKG structure. The knowledge graph part asserted using unified cybersecurity ontology includes the information that a product Microsoft Internet Explorer has available to execute arbitrary code and denial of service that can be exploited by remote attackers using the means crafted website. The knowledge graph entities are linked to their vector embeddings using the relation has vector. Here is a query processing agent built on the VKG structure. An input query QVKG can be decomposed to multiple components that can run on different parts, namely the knowledge graph part and the vector part. For a cybersecurity example, let a query input be infer an alert if a vulnerability similar to denial of service is listed in my SQL. The idea here is a part of the query about searching should run on the vector space model and the list and the info part should run on the knowledge graph. Thank you for listening to this presentation. You can reach me at my email ID listed here. Have a good day.